My name is Tyler Dinjo, 28, fighting out of London, and I'm representing GB Top Team. I feel great to be fighting from, for PFL. I got the opportunity about eight weeks ago, so I've known for a while. I've been training hard for this fight. I've been watching PFL for a while, so I know who they are. I like the, the tournament format, and I like the fact that they keep you busy. So the aim is to have multiple fights a year, which is what I'm trying to do. Um, and I'm just looking to prove myself and show people what I'm about, and what I'm about is finishes. To be honest, I just, I went to like a youth club in my area. They were doing kickboxing classes and I just tried it out and I sort of fell in love with it and I just kept going. I never thought I was going to fight MMA, um, but after I had my first like, amateur kickboxing by 18, I decided that it was the path I was going to take and yeah, I just, I fell in love with it. I like fighting, I like, I like the violence behind it, I like the skill behind it. The energy release it gives me makes me feel good really, so I just, I just kept it rolling and, and we're here now. And I feel like I should have been here earlier, but you know, injuries and life gets in the way. I've, I've been doing this for about 10 years, but I've say half of those years I've been injured, I've had surgeries, just, just life going on. But now I'm focused and I'm ready just to, just to push on and get these victories and make my way to the top. been good. Um, I feel like with people my size, it's always, you always have that issue where you're struggling to find training partners that are your size. And I feel like here, I've been working with welterweights, middleweights, even the, the big boys that lie heavy. So they've been pushing me through throughout the camp. It's been, it's been a pleasure to spar with all of them. So shout out to them. Um, the coaching's been good as well. I've been working with Brad and Ash mainly. They've been working on a lot of my weaknesses and enhancing, enhancing the skills that I already have as well. So that's also been good. So I feel, I feel ready. Um, I, feel, I feel ready to go and I'm, I'm so sort of excited to, to push on and get this finish. I think I'm going to come in there composed, relaxed, um, pick my shots, pick my takedowns, move and just flow. And I feel like I will always see an opening and when I do see that open, opening, I'm going to capitalise. But of course, I'll be pushing to finish the fight because that's what I'm about. All the victories I've had are finished and I want to I wanna keep that going. I want to I wanna continue finishing these guys and sort of announce myself on this platform. What makes me different? I'm entertaining. I bring creativity, I flow, I move, I've got good rhythm um, in there when it comes to fighting and I push to finish the fight so it's never boring when you're watching me. Um, even when I'm throwing a jab you can see that I'm doing it with intent and I'm, and I'm going for something so yeah, I'll, I'll be entertaining and I'll be pushing to finish the fight so that's why they should watch me. Shout out to all of my coaches, uh, training partners that have got me to this point. Um, I've trained with a lot of guys globally, um, here in Europe, away from Europe, um, and they've all helped me, um, all helped me improve my game. So I wanted to thank everyone there. I wanted to thank my friends and family who continuously support me, who continue to try and keep me motivated in this path, and they're always there to support. So just thanks to everyone, really. Um, and thanks to GB Top Team for having me. It's been a short stay, but hopefully it continues. <laughs> <laughs>